Hello everyone, I'm Sir Trooper and welcome back to a, another video. Today I'm show you guys how to install a custom loading screen into your guys' 5M server. The first thing you guys are going to want to do, hit the first link down in the description below. I'll bring you guys right here to the GitHub page for BD loading screen, which is going to be the mod for the loading screen itself. Under releases, hit the latest version and then click source code zip. Once that's done downloading, open the zip file on up and you should see the BD loading screen folder. So that's going to be the actual mod we drag into our 5M server. It's pretty straightforward from here. All you guys are going to want to do, minimize your desktop and find your guys' 5M server. Mine's right here. It's the exact same server I've been using for every single video in the 2024 series. Open your 5M server on up. CX data, CFX default and resources. Inside of here, we're going to right click, new folder, and we're going to call this folder loading. And make sure you guys put brackets on the beginning and the end. Because brackets are a nice way to organize our 5M servers. So every single time we add a mod, which is to do with loading in, we can put it into our loading subcategory folder and we only need to ensure this one folder. So we can drag and drop as many things as we want into here and we do not need to ensure them. So to do this, we're going to grab our loading screen. We're going to rename it to just BD loan screen to so get rid of that part on the end and drag and drop it into our loading folder. We're done with that. So we can close that download. We're going to go to resources. I'm going to copy the name of our category folder and for the last time for anything to do with loading we're just going to ensure this category so open your server.cfg on up scroll on down to the last ensure line and type ensure and control v in the name of our subcategory folder for all the loading mods file save and just like that we are done if you guys wanted to as well just so you guys can see i've done here you can add a nice little title above it by doing two hashtags, which makes it so the server.cfg won't like read it as a line of code. And then we can just do loading screen mods. So we know everything below here is going to be to do with loading if we did want to create a second subcategory folder. But make sure you save all the changes you've made in your server.cfg. Close that, and now we are done. Go back to your resources folder and go back to that loading screen folder we made and open up the loading screen mod. If you take a look inside of the index.html and we open that up with Notepad or Notepad++, I definitely recommend using Notepad++. It makes your life so much easier when it comes to reading lines of code. It just sort of organizes it a lot better than your standard Notepad does. If we scroll on down a little bit, you guys can see through here, there's a bunch of lines you can edit. So you can edit the people, that the staff team. You can also edit all the different lines. So what it says for joining a server, and you can change your Discord links, your TikTok links, basically, you can configure the entire loading screen through here and everything you can change. Literally everything in the loading screen you can change. Really, really useful and great customization in your guys' 5M server. But eventually, around line 132, you should see the actual link for changing the YouTube video. Now, the YouTube video it comes with from standard is actually pretty solid, pretty good YouTube video. But say if you wanted to change this, find yourself a free YouTube loading screen. Here's one right here. And all you guys need to do, go to share. And then embed and see this part right here up until the question mark we're going to copy that so up until the question mark from the https we're going to copy that go back to our index or html and see this part in between the quotes here and up until the question mark we're just going to replace that with our youtube video instead and then we can save it and we can also close it unless you guys want to make some more changes here you can obviously change the logo but you can also do that just through the actual loan screen mod itself. So if we go back to the mod here, you see we can change the logo that it comes with. When you change the logo, just make sure you also name your logo file logo.png since that will be the file it's looking for. And same with the songs, you can also change the songs here as well if you wanted to. But other than that, we're pretty much done. We should be good to load up our 5M server and see our brand new loading screen. So like that you guys can see our beautiful new loading screen with the YouTube video that we changed it to. Pretty simple, pretty easy, and a nice little bit of customization you guys can do to your 5M server just to make it yours. So I hope you guys did find this video useful. If you did, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you guys are looking to create your own dream 5M server and you can't be bothered with all the tutorials and all the setting up and you just want to get straight into it, then be sure to check out HTNetwork.1 down in the description below and check out one of the packages because you can literally set up a 5M server using the HD Network Auto Installer with over 200 mods in literally a couple of minutes. So other than that, I'll see all of you guys in the next video. Cheers and goodbye.